and she will let you go. I like f this. I'm moving out now. That's it. <laughs> Feed the kitchen and do the cat, but that's not. <laughs> everyone so I thought I would do a little update and um, yeah because I don't think I've been on YouTube for a couple of weeks excuse the state of me I am very run down very tired <laughs> I've got kind of like a cold it's not COVID I've had a test I've got like hay fever and everything and that's kind of acting up my dizziness and everything else but anyway so I'm doing an update I look exhausted because I'm not getting much sleep because my three daughters I have four daughters Three of them are arguing all the time at the moment, and it's frying my brain. It's very stressful. I wish they'd stop. <laughs> There's more to worry about than what you're arguing about. Come on now. Seriously, stop it. So, anyway, my update is. Let me see. Let me see. See that? Yes, I'm moving again. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm moving I'm moving out of this new built house and moving into an old house by the time you watch this video I would have already moved I'm going to make it um, kind of like a moving vlog so yes I'm moving into an old it's, I live in Scotland if anybody new to my channel I live in Ayrshire so the type of house I'm moving to is an upper cottage flat basically what that means is like Two big houses and they're split into like four flats, upper and lower on the left and upper and lower on the right. So I'm moving into an upper cottage flat. And mostly moving because where it is, is central to town, literally just a few minutes of walk away from all the shops that I go to where, where I am at the moment. It could take me a good 40 minutes to get to where I'm going walking um, because there's no buses near me to go to the shops. And also here, because I've got internal stairs, um, I suffer with con costochondritis, which is a, a rib pain problem, and it can get quite severe. And so going up and down the stairs a lot, it aggravates my ribs. So when that flares up, literally having to come downstairs to get a drink of water is, is a, it's just a nightmare. So yes, I know you're saying, but you're moving to an upper cottage flat. Yes, it's got stairs to go in it, but once you're in the flat, it's all one level. So that's what I'm moving for, to be in town and everything. And also the street that I'm moving on um, is at the other end of where my one of my daughters lives. So she'll probably move out now that she knows I'm going to be evening. <laughs> and I'm not joking. <laughs> uh, she will let you go. I'm like, F this, I'm moving out now. That's it, mum's in the street. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh, but it's the truth. <laughs> but yeah. So I'm going to be living in the street, the same street as one of my daughters. My parents are just around the corner. And as I said, I'm central to town. So, and that's why I'm moving. So, yeah. So I'm in the middle of packing at the moment. I've just had some dinner. I've got mascara everywhere because it's already, it's quarter cool past five. But I'm, as I said, I'm absolutely shattered. I've been up kind of stressing all night with my daughters bloody arguing. Stop it again. Like. Mum's had enough now. <laughs> I'm not even going grey-haired, I'm going white-haired. Seriously, literally, like, when they say the kids are going to be the death of me, my daughters are literally going to be the death of me. Stop it. Like, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> so, as I said, I'm kind of like, you can see the state of the place. It's just a riot. But, um, yeah. I've also got my COVID jag next week, so that's going to be fun on my son's birthday as well. Um, my son Grant that lives with me still. So, yes, yeah, so I'm just I was just in the middle of watching um, The Bold Type on Netflix. And, um, a lot of these bags that's here, though, at the moment, is where my daughter's moved out. A lot of this is still hers. And I presume I'm going to have to... This lighting's no good. I'm going to have to store it up in the loft in the other place. As I said, I'm moving into a, a quite an old house. It needs a lot of work done in the sense of decoration. The the couple that's there, they've kept it like beautiful. It's clean. It's lovely. But obviously, the decoration's not my type of decorating. Uh, not my colours. Not my style kind of thing. So 
and um, yeah, so that all that's going to be changed. It's also like a massive garden. Excuse me, and as they're not gardeners, they've just literally li ripped out all the bushes and the. Sh <laughs> Excuse me, I've just had dinner. All the shrubbery and everything. There's nothing. All it is is pebbles in this massive garden. But that's kind of good for me. It's a big blank canvas. So we've already set out plans what we're going to do with that. It's probably going to take really like a couple of years to get it going. We'll see how it goes. But yeah. So there's going to be lots of updates. Sorry about my swaying. If you're new to my channel, I suffer with dizziness, so I sway a lot. So I do apologise if it's making you seasick. <laughs> but yeah, so... Um, yes, there's going to be lots of decorating videos and lots of DIY, upcycling, that kind of thing. Gardening, just all that kind of thing. I'll do some more moving vlogs. It's going to be added onto this video probably. I might do this little video first. Just a kind of like sneak peek surprise kind of thing. <laughs> Even though I look an absolute riot. Um, but yeah, so there's going to be all that coming. And if you're new to my channel, hi, hello, thanks for subscribing. I'm Diane. I'm a mum of seven and a grandmother to 11. <laughs> I don't like saying grandmother. I usually say nana. Why did I say grandmother? That makes me sound so old. <laughs> I'm a nana to 11. I have 11 grandchildren, hence why course in the white hair but yeah so this is what looks shattered <laughs> yeah so it's gonna be all fun and games yes all fun and games i've got boxes and bags and stuff everywhere as i said i've just had my dinner while i was watching that netflix series i need to tidy up the kitchen because it is a bit of a riot i'm gonna put a washing on while it's kind of cheaper in the day to run the electric i'm gonna put the washing on take down I need to turn the back off this light because I want to take my light shades down and stuff like that and yes so that's our that's our it's more my update because you know is my my son was going to move out at some point he's going to put his put in for his own house kind of thing I mean he's a grown ass man <laughs> he's nearly 30 but he still loves me because of his epilepsy that's why he lives with me in case anybody's going oh god that's a bit weird no He's, as I said, he's nearly 30, but he's got episode, three types of epilepsy, so it's safer with um, him living with me or someone else. So eventually he will move out or move in with a friend or something like that. I don't know. Why am I talking about him? I'm blithering on. So I'm going to go now, guys. As I said, I'm going to do some washings and tidy it up and uh, maybe do some more pack a lacking. I'll see how I feel because I'm pretty tired. <laughs> Oh, pretty bushed. I think the kitchen will be enough for me. Do the kit. I was going to say, do the kitchen and feed the cat. Almost said. <laughs> feed the kitchen and do the cat. But that's not... <laughs> I'm going to clean the kitchen and then I'm going to feed the cat. <laughs> oh, look. I've just got stuff everywhere. I've run out of tape, so I need to go into town. Probably tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah, maybe Friday. And I need to go to Poundland to get a load of tape. And I need to go to Wilco and get Shadow's worming and flea treatment. Because she's due, she's due the worming. She's, you know, she's probably going to be due another flea treatment, I think, it's next week. Still got some in the drawer, but I like to stock up. Some of you are probably saying, yeah, take it to the vet. Yeah, I could take it to the vet. But she's had flea treatment at the vet before, and it failed big time. So I've always used Wilco's flea treatment. And obviously with COVID and everything, I don't particularly want to be standing outside in the long queue outside the vets. When I can worm her at home, as much as a pain in the backside it is trying to get her to take the tablet, I can worm her at home and it's worked so far. And I've had her five years, I've had no problems. So I'm going to do that. So I need to go to Wilco and get her treatment and stuff. And I need to pop into, well, I don't need to pop into Poundland. Obviously it's not essential, but I'm going to anyway. I want to get some of the bulbs, the plants, the flowers and that that they sell um, to put into our new garden because there's literally nothing in it, <laughs> like nothing, it's just pebbles, so yeah, but yeah, I hope you guys will stay tuned for more updates and um, yeah, you'll see lots more to come, but anyway, thanks for watching and if you're not subscribed please subscribe and don't forget to click the like button to show me that you like this video and don't forget to click the notification bell i, s I feel so cheesy when i say it like that hi and don't forget to click the like button <laughs>
But anyway, don't forget, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe. So take care. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now. Thank you.